What up? Welcome back to Wizard for Real. Shout out to the real squad. Squad up, squad up, squad up. Get it, real squad. Oh, oh, if you would like to be part of the real squad, please click the subscribe button, like and comment, and click the bell. Boop! For notifications. All right, so we in Chicago, and you know you can't come to Chicago without going to the world famous Harold's Chicken. So we walked to Harold's. We ended up getting uh, the wings with mild sauce and fries. Uh, I got the wings with the mild sauce on the side, not by choice. And I also got a pizza puff. You know, you got to get a pizza puff. They don't really sell pizza puffs here, but I got one. So we made it back to the room and we was actually kind of tired, y'all. So we really didn't eat the food for y'all on camera. But we definitely gave y'all a full review while we were sitting on the couch. You see them chicken strips? Ooh, you see that chicken? Ooh, look at it. Yes. Well, yeah, we was very tired. We had j literally just got off the road um, and then walked down the street, got some Harold's. We was lucky because Harold's was like one street over from our hotel. But um, yeah, man, check out our review. Uh, as we're sitting on the couch, and we hope you guys enjoy our review. Let me not look over at her, because something is wrong with my wife today. But we just left uh, Harold's Chicken, and we just wanted to let y'all know how it was. Uh, and so we'll go ahead and, uh, well, we won't rate it until the end. We'll just talk about it a little bit. So just give me your perspective. So Harold's Chicken Shack is, some of it is Harold's Chicken and then Harold's Chicken Shack is on the south side of Chicago. You got the mild sauce, right? Which is kind of tastes like barbecue sauce mixed with ketchup. It might just be barbecue sauce. Uh, fried chicken, the, cri the chicken was crispy. Um, and it was good. I got mild sauce all over mine and he poured his. So she put mine on the side, and I didn't even ask her to do that, y'all. Well, I didn't know if you was gonna like the sauce or not. She didn't even ask me. She just assumed. So I she didn't, didn't have the drench. I had to drench it myself. It was like crispy, but I wanted the drenchy, drenchy. Right. But I think you would have liked it. You liked it better the way it was. Stop, TJ. I'm sorry about the camera angles. I don't have my um, tripod, tripod. And, my, and my arm hurts. Mm -hmm. But I thought it was good. Um, it was about a block away from our hotel, so we was able to walk because mm -hmm. parking is scarce in the Chicago. city of Chicago. So we're in the um, McCormick Place, Place area. area. So uh, I thought it was cool. Nice mm -hmm. little walk. Um, traffic is crazy. A lot of busy streets. So if you got kids, might not be a good idea to walk. But if you do walk, Keep them close to you, cause they drive crazy here in Chicago. They is not gonna stop. You are going to get ran over. But the food was good though. I had a pizza puff too. Um, pizza puffs are popular in Chicago, so I had to make sure I give me a pizza puff. Pizza. Puff. Um, so it was good. Pizza puff is really um, stop like a hot pocket. Um, our son in the background acting stupid, but like we can't. You know how when you concentrating you talking and the kid think you still don't see them I and see he them. wasn't even he wasn't even trying to go to the next room until we start recording so. right you just it's, being annoying it's crazy he at the stage to work look at that view uh -oh, that's, the, light. that's the lamp in the way but that's lake michigan back there but mm -hmm. nah um so yeah harold's chicken i give him a four out of five it was good chicken was good the mild sauce it was good. That was my first time having my own sauce. Um, uh, LaCrissa got mine on the side. I ain't asked her to. But I put it... <laughs> I don't think... I first on, of all, because... But I put it on the chicken. <laughs> you get different a different perspective if it's on the side or on the chicken. So I wanted him to get his I looked at yours and was like, I want mine to look like hers. I, I even, when I, even when I put mine on there, 
it still like has some dry parts because so they got a method of drenching it and I wasn't able to drench mine. Because I normally get mild sauce on it and on the side in case they miss a part. But mine was a 4-2. Um, now, last time I came to Chicago, they automatically put the lemon pepper seasoning on there. I guess you got to ask now. Yeah, if it's something you want, you need to ask. But for. normally it's just on there. You don't let them decide. You don't let them decide to not put it on there. The chicken was crispy, but I needed my lemon pepper seasoning. Yeah, so you need to make sure you ask. Next time. Ask for what you want. I really want to try. I've had Harold's before. We had have a Harold's in St. Louis now. Um, I ain't want to try it there first. I wanted to try it here mm -hmm. first. So that's why I didn't even eat it in St. Louis yet. So I ate it here in the original place and it was good. And so now I can eat it at home. And get the real perspective. All mild sauce is the same. For some reason, I didn't think it was as sweet. It is a little bit sweeter than I remember, but it's good though. To me, it just tastes like ketchup, hot sauce, and like some sugar. Like some brown sugar. Mm-hmm. Like a little. I mean, it's it's good. I ain't. I'm not saying that the. I'm not saying that to criticize it. I'm just saying. I was expecting like. I don't know what I was expecting, but. It was. It was good though. It was a yeah, good combination. Good. On, it was a good sauce to go on your cheek. But you know, I like saucy wings. And so, next time, I'll uh, be sure that I get my, my sauce on the wings and not on the side. Um, so, but that's what we got, y'all. Hope y'all enjoyed. We're going to go to a couple other places. We plan to hit a couple of chicago staples um we ain't gonna say word because in case we don't make it mm. yeah what she said but we definitely gonna try to get some italian beef in a chicago style hot dog you gotta get that you gotta get that and then sh shout out to uh corporate on youtube because he always pumping up jerk 48 so we're planning to go to jerk 48 um so hopefully we get there hopefully we at least get to jerk 48 and the italian beef in the hot dog place before we leave and we definitely got to get a deep dish pizza. We don't know which place we're going to go to to get deep dish. But we'll we'll make it happen. With that being said, man, don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, share, share, share. We'll sense for real. Shout out to Biggie. It's Biggie right there. Huh? Uh, till next time, we're going to holler. We out this time. Peace.